All right, you know what? Um, I, well, I will say one thing. I was a bit scared. Well, not scared. I was kind of disappointed. Um, well, for a variety of reasons. One, I wouldn't be able to use the thing anymore. And um, I was like, oh, Christ, I'm going to have to buy another one and whatever. And I was like, shoot, I really, I really did break it. Um, I just couldn't get anything in here. And I was like, this doesn't make sense based on, anyways, it, it did make sense because I, um, I used way too much material. I was using the wrong, um, like there's slight different thicknesses. This one's a B for, I don't know, B for base or something. And, uh, E for, I guess, embossing, but they're slightly, th that one's a slightly thinner. Anyways, I was using, I just wasn't, I uh, wasn't using the right combos. And this is the big kick-ass one. I'm, you're not supposed to use this one unless it's, um, well, it doesn't matter. Because, I mean, it's called cutting. But, I mean, don't go down that road is what I'm, uh, at least I, I shouldn't say don't you. Like, I gotta stop doing that, man. Um, I'm not going to go down that road. Well, I just looked at these as tools. I'm like, well, I don't give an F what you're called. Uh, you're just that thickness. That's what you are and that's what you're going to be. And if I need to add thicknesses to some things that are in between, I just add paper shims. Uh, anyways, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so I saw these things a few weeks ago at the dollar store. And I was like, well, I think you're a stencil or something. But I'm like, well, I'm going to try and use you as an embossing um, template. And look, I don't know if you can see it, but I'll try to. Maybe not the best. I'll try. I'll try here. But you, it actually does come out really darn well. I'll try to. Sorry if I'm driving you nuts and you're like, for Christ's sakes, I saw it for the first time and you, you just stop. Um, but uh, what I'm trying to say is I can now make my own because I know now. If you don't think I know how to turn a design. Hold on here. This is where my chipboard is. Um, these are all my spare pieces. Right, so, or, oh, no, those are my, so, where are you? They're over here. Um, get over here, you freak. So, yeah, like, these are just my leftover tiddly bits, right? So, well, uh, if you don't think I don't know how to make, um, a, a, like, a print, I mean, come on, anybody can do that. I, I'll just make my own design uh, stencil and then make my own embossing. So, I'm thinking, holy smokes, maybe it would be a kind of a neat idea to start doing some, uh, uh, terrain, uh, like dungeon terrain, um, you know, tile, um, like dungeon walls, uh, other stuff like yet again, uh, just to embellish maybe when I'm going to maybe do a diorama of, um, whenever I get down to that, uh, bit of, like I said, I'm a relative of the Hafsburg. So what do you expect from me? But look at that. Even this little bit looks like a castle wall kind of thing. I don't care what kind of flipping printer you have. You're not going to get that. Um, you need an embossing machine and this sweetheart is just, oh my God, geez, I, I'm, I'm just saying, I, I got to do a proper review or send a, um, or tell, uh, like talk to this flipping company and say, look, man, I've done things that this thing, um, you know, was never, I mean, I'm sure I would scare the, whoever's, um, but uh, like I was talking to Zoe, I think this is what's going to go. I mean, it's going to be that bit here because I've, you know, I've taken, I've punished the living crap. I, I just love it, man. Uh, so that's it. I'm going to try to figure out eventually what to do, like, um, uh, try to make my own designs or something like that because they're, it's coming out darn well. And this is just on blue paper. I haven't even, remember, I haven't even colored in. Let's start doing that. Um, oh, jeepers jumping. This is going to be fun. Um, yeah, it is. It's just going to be fun. All right. See ya.